it's Brittany and welcome back to my playroom. Hello everyone, I'm back at you today with another doll box opening. Um, this one is going to be pretty interesting. So I don't know how many of my followers out there are Toy Story fans. I mean, I'm assuming a lot of us are because we love toys and dolls and all that. But anyway, so I came across the Gabby Gabby doll that was made in Brazil. Um, Gabby Gabby is like the kind of mean doll in Toy Story 4 that steals Woody's voice box. Um, or, well, he gives it away, but anyway. Um, and then you find out that she's not really a villain, she's just a lonely doll that wants to be played with. So I actually found a really good replica of the Gabby Gabby doll that was made in Brazil from Baby Brinks Toys. I'll have to put the link down below. But we're gonna get into this box opening and take a look at her. So the U.S. did release um, Gabby Gabby, but she was an all plastic, finally plastic doll. She didn't have rooted hair or anything like that. And I just really love her character. So I thought it would be fun to pick this doll up and share her with you guys for all of my Toy Story fans out there as I am. I love Toy Story. I don't care how old you are. It's still a super fun watch. Um, so here is the box and she looks really cute. Let me get rid of the big box. So the back of the box actually has a picture of Gabby Gabby the doll and um, what the doll is supposed to look like. And it says Disney Pixar Toy Story 4. Gabby Gabby has rooted hair. Um, she has painted eyes and she's supposed to be vinyl, I believe. And the maker of the Gabby Gabby doll from Brazil is Baby Brink. That is the maker of this Gabby Gabby doll. So she's really cute. I love the box. The box is amazing. So let's take a quick look at her. Ready guys? Ta-da! So here she is. She's really cute. I don't know what I expected. Um, I think she's adorable. I do kind of wish they had given her inset eyes. Maybe ones that open and close like she does in the movie. But here is her movie photo. She's super cute even though she's kind of mean in the beginning. But doesn't really mean to be. And then here's the doll itself. So let's go ahead and get her out of the box, guys, and take a close-up look of Gabby Gabby. Okay, guys, so we got her out of her box, and she does have a really cute box, by the way. Um, she smells amazing. She smells like baby powder. Um, they have her hair in the little ponytails like it is in the movies. Um, she's got a really sweet face with freckles and green eyes and rosy pink lips or pinkish red lips and then she's got on her yellow and white polka dot dress her little white socks and her yellow shoes and it looks like she'll be fairly easy to get out and um, it looks like there's a hook here so let's make this quick huh yeah that was simple enough and then it looks like she has a little attachment at her feet and that was it guys, she is out of the box. Super, super easy. Um, so she's adorable. I kind of feel like I need to fix her hair just but, um, a little bit. She's got the little ponytail holders with the yellow ribbon at the top of her hair. She's definitely got a little bit of box hair, so we'll have to comb that out. But she's got really cute hair. Um, looks like she's rooted fairly well. Maybe it's hard to tell in these ponytails. So I don't want to say that right off the bat without really looking at her. But there's the top of her hair. Um, she's actually kind of sort of adorable. Um, but here's a really good close up of her face. I think she's super cute. I love her little freckles. I love her hair. I think her hair is super pretty. I love her little dress. Um, she is articulated at the shoulder. So her arms do move up and down, but not side to side. Um, her head turns left to right, but not up and down, just left to right. And then her legs move up and down as well. So she can kind of sit with that open leg look. So I've brushed Gabby Gabby's hair out a little bit and taken a better look at her, just to give you some little details about Gabby. Um, so the doll retails for around $69 on eBay, which is where I purchased her. I've noticed that price is fluctuating a little bit from $69 to $79. Some places are even asking $89 for her. Do I think she's worth that much? Well, this is what I've got to say about that. So Gabby Gabby's hair is rooted really sparsely. Um, there's absolutely no hair rooting um, here at all in between her 
rooting at the top and around and the rooting here. This is bald and this is bald. So you could never take Gabby Gabby's hair out of the ponytails because you would have bald here and here. Um, her eyes are beautiful. However, I do wish for that price point they had given her um, glass eyes or acrylic eyes. And I would like to have seen an open and closed feature for those as well. Um, she does have a really cute dress. The fabric is really nice. The hair quality, although sparse, is really nice as well. Um, I'm not exactly sure what type of hair this is, but it's not the worst I've seen. I do kind of like her hair. And since I'm not going to be taking it out of the ponytails, the bald spots don't bother me. So she'll be staying in the ponytails for sure. <laughs> she does come with these little white bloomers, which are adorable. Um, so she does have those. And then she also has these little white socks with lace trim and then the little yellow shoes. And there in the bottom and there is the back. So all in all, I really do like the Gabby Gabby doll. And personally, I think she's going to be great for my Toy Story collection. So that's why I got her. Um, is she overpriced? Probably just a little bit. I feel like more could have been done with her as far as her eyes and a little more hair rooting. And as far as the posability, she's about the same as the Disney animator dolls, which usually retail for about $24 to $39, depending on what specific doll it is. Usually you can get them for around $29. So that probably should have been her price point. But I do think she's a really cute doll and should be cute in the collection. So that's it guys for my review of the Toy Story 4 Gabby Gabby doll from Baby Brinks. Um, I do think she's an adorable doll and she will probably just sit on a shelf for the rest of my collection. Um, if you guys have any questions, please feel free to leave them in a comment below. Um, and let me know what you guys think of the Gabby Gabby doll. Would you buy Gabby Gabby for $69? Let me know. Um, but thank you guys so much for joining me today on my box opening. I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye guys.